right, man. What a day. It's beautiful out here. Leaves are changing colors. Hey, buddy, how you doing? We got people out enjoying the beautiful day. And it is about that time of year when I like to make sure that I am ready for what's ahead, and that is winter. So winter preps, super important. Who's that? Hey, what you up to? What are you doing? Fancy seeing you. What are you doing? Come on over. I'm, I'm checking out, making sure I'm all set for the winter time. I was trying to get a little exercise out of the corporate for a moment, yeah. and you're out here doing some what? I'm doing real work. Okay, trying, let's see what this trying is. To, trying to talk to the people. Hi, people. That's what right. is going on here? Check it out. So, oh, look, it's a Tesla. It is my Tesla. Um, yeah, no, this there's weekend. There's nothing in there. It looks like there's nothing in there. Oh, it's but a bunker? I've got a secret door <gasps> right here. I've got all my preps ready to go for the winter time. And not just that, I also have a gallon of water over on this side. So, I have a half a gallon of water. Why don't you help me grab some of the stuff? We'll take it over to the picnic table and unpack it. All right. Manual labor. All right. All right. Yeah, let's check it out. He got chains, not the kind you wear around your neck because he'd look hot in those. Becky, Becky, Becky. What am I going to do with that? Little herringbone necklace. Hey, give my good side, Bobby. Don't get the back side. All right, let's lay it all out. Oh. Becky, can you believe I got all this? Becky, please, focus. I just, I came, and parks make me want to nap. You're going to get your makeup on my sleeping bag. Come on. Okay, do I wear, we talked about know. Ulta. I, I don't I know. don't wear makeup. Okay, well, I whatever. I don't out. like schmears on my stuff, all right? Okay. okay, so here we are. This. Can you believe all this was in the back of my trunk? Yeah, it, did. it was like in a bunker, yeah. special yeah. bunker. It's got a special little... But wait, why don't you have a spare tire in there? Well, that's one of the problems with the Tesla. They do not carry spares. So if you are in need of a spare, this is why for my Another car... Another reason to not no, no, have no. a Tesla. That's no the only tire. reason, one of the reasons. Um, it's good to have a fix a flat because this is very super easy. You just wait, attach it not, and... So you do have air in your tires? They're not just like solid yeah, rubber? No, like there's, a, there's like air, a, but fix a flat tells... So anyway, here it is. This is my winter preps. And yeah, I, I made sure that I had a trunk ready to go in case of an eventuality on the road. Because you never know. Uh, the last time you want to be thinking about being um, being ready is when you need to be ready. I have a problem. Yeah. When you think like all-terrain vehicle, snow, mountain passes, right. do you think Tesla? Well, Teslas do very well in that. But here's the thing. Many people who think that they are riding around in a 4x4 and have nothing to worry about, they also need to be prepared. I've been in 4x4s. I've been stuck. It's not a pleasant thing. Whether you have a 4x4 or a front wheel or a rear wheel, doesn't matter. What do you have? What wheel? All wheel? These are all wheel. Okay. Right here. So at any rate, let me get through this, all right? So here's what we got. The first thing you need to have is water. I need some water. Water. All right. Water. I Jersey keep this water. in the back of my trunk. Just one of these? Well, you like to... My general rule of thumb is have a gallon for each person. Okay. Um, and so I'm probably a little light there, but at least I've got a gallon of water. Okay. You can never have too much water, okay? But anyway, uh, but a gallon of water is probably the best thing. And then to go along with that, I would say the next thing that you need to be thinking about is staying warm, right? Shelter, especially in a winter situation, get stuck on the side of the road. Uh, if, if you, you know, you're going to run the, the car, you, you're going to have your heater on all night, maybe. You may want to conserve that. You may not have fuel. That may be the reason you're stuck on the side of the road. So I always like to have a couple things to keep warm. This is just a sleeping bag. You know, it's a sleeping bag. It's called a Rob Dog 4. Yeah, it, you know, the, the point is, it's warmth, okay? And it's going to be a heck of a lot it's more comfortable. It's super light, and it is very cushy. Yeah, and you can get them is it smaller. A single? Is it a single? Like, well, it depends it, how many people. I'm, I'm sure you can unzip it and use it as a blanket. Yeah, that's okay? right. Yeah, that's good. Yeah. I like that. So the other couple things that I've got rest. from a, a warmth standpoint, well, I'll tell you what. Why don't we go ahead and we'll hit the, the other elements of this. Food, of course, I always like to have some good nutritious food on hand. Do you have all hand. the variants? I do. I have an Alpha, Bravo, and Charlie of our, of our NREs. Here's the Alpha, the, the Bravo, and the Charlie. Why are they not in order? And it'll, <laughs> good question. It, it you know certainly allows you to open them up and mix and match if you want to do that. So that's good to have on hand. One of these things is a, a day's ration, so good stuff, right? And then, of course, you want to have chains. Chains because if you are at risk of being stuck or need to get through over the pass, you need to have chains ready to go. This whole thing scares me. If I have to put chains on my tires, I'm not going. I don't yeah. care. And if it, there's a chance that I might have chains on my tires, I'm rescheduling. Well, that's sometimes not possible. Um, but this is a super easy thing to do. 
a lot of people don't take the time to look up what size tire they have. Every tire so on the side of the tire, it tells so you the scary. exact measurements. Or just go to Amazon, look it up. Can That's we do a follow-up video on you putting these on? Oh, I could put these Teaching on in about on. five minutes. And what you want to make sure you do too is know how to put them on. Don't wait until you're stuck in weather, your hands and fingers aren't working like they should be. I've done this before. Helped yeah. a friend out and both of our hands were frozen yeah, before exactly. we could get them on. Know, know how to get them on. Is that it's, it? It's, this is one of the, yeah, it's one of the things, right? So it's very easy to get on. We can definitely do a follow-up video on that. But practice is the point. Practice, don't just have them like, okay, I got the chain. Is there four of them in there? There's two. One, you know, both uh, Wait, rear you tires. Wait, why don't you put them on off? Because you need two, technically. All right. Can I use four? You could use six if you wanted to, but you probably only need two. That's, how many that's tires ridiculous. You don't you don't be two. snappy. I'm right. asking real questions. All right. Okay. We'll get two. The Four. important thing is make sure that the chains you get fit the tires of your vehicle. Yeah. I think okay. I have two, 265, 65, 18. Is that such a number? Yeah, of course. Okay. I just got new tires yesterday. Well, there you go. That's my winter that's, that's great. That's great. Yeah. You need to be ready. Okay. So there's that. We already talked about the fix a flat. All right, so now we're going to do the bug out bag. What's in there? All right, this is, um, oh, this is my standard apart. buzz out ba bug out bag, but it's but it's good for the winter time as well. Okay, how about I hand you some things? Yeah, please do that. Because I want to see. I want to see. So what the you're first doing. thing is, I've got a rain poncho because inclement weather, you know, it'll be a little bit more comfortable if you're dry than if you're wet. Is this jet, really a boil, jet boil. Jet boil, very easy to have on hand. Uh, serves as a container, so if you need to Whoa. scoop snow, you can certainly do that and melt. Uh, melt snow and turn it into water. Okay, I should have a propane in there. Okay, good. And if we get really special, we could even start that guy up. This is fun. Can you give Open me up this that for bag Christmas? for me, will you? What bag? This one? Um, the other one. This one? Look for a fire starter stick in Look there. Look at this. This is like a bug out bag in a bug out bag. It's yeah. like a zip bug out yeah. bag. Yeah, no, don't open all that. But Wait, one of the cool want? things that's fun about uh, sp uh, my spark. No, nope, keep going. Oh, the like that black Zippo thing? Here, let me show you. All right. You gonna eat these? Where's my flint? Here it is. He's got food in there too, folks. And he's got a note to himself. Give Becky a raise. That's <laughs> my thing. No, I don't know what this All is. All right, this will work. Okay. Wait, why do you have this? Band-Aid spot. You took inventory? Yeah, 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 definitely. You know, you want to keep that stuff straight. To make sure you well, remember do you, do you cross what it you're off doing. When, do you have a pen in here to cross it off if you need it? All right, so let's see what we got here. Okay, good. Okay. Oh, you're taking me out so to that, lunch? So that'll work. All right, so this is how I like to light it. You don't even need matches for a jet foil, right? Kind of like this guy. You can hear yeah. it. Right? Ah. Ah. I'm afraid. I hate propane. There okay. it is. I'm okay with that. So I just started a jet foil with a uh, ferrous rod in. and a knife, all right? So jet boils are great to have, obviously. That was pretty impressive, Eric. Yeah. So super easy, right? And all you need to do then is Oh, get here's your... more of your fire lid. Yep, yep. Okay. Good stuff. Is that the that's the thing to hold the pot? No, actually. Or that holds, it, that's it, the stand it, for it. It, it so. holds this if you needed to, but you really don't even need it. Okay. Um, yeah, so this is your jet boil stove itself. Okay. And you can heat water for your food, or if you just want to melt snow, you can do that as well. All right. So jet boils are always great to have on hand, and they're super easy. These uh, these these fuel guys last for quite a while. Um, I always like to have, you know, one on hand. All right. So there we go. All right. Yep. Oh, this is like new skin. That is mole skin. So we talked about the fire. Now, given that this is a winter situation, this is something you need to have, especially if you're talking about putting chains on. You need to put a, a headlamp into your bug out bag. Yeah. So if you're out there in the middle of the night, you've That's got hands-free light and you can put stuff on uh, your car as you need. These are great, okay? What is this? So anyway, make sure that you have a headlamp with you. If you don't have a headlamp, a flashlight will do okay. okay I'm just but these you. things you can buy for five, 10 bucks now um, off Amazon, so not a big deal at all. All right, so you need to have light. The other okay, thing you need to have this, is... Clean yourself. Yeah, don't worry about that yet. This is a compass. Okay, this basically tells you north. Um, most of the time you're gonna be okay without that, okay? In a, in a winter situation if you're stuck on the side of the road. But you probably do wanna have, in addition to a jet boil, or if you don't have a jet boil, you need something to help keep you warm. And 
That's what this candle will do for you. Okay. Does it smell like ambiance? And the nice thing about this candle versus a stick candle, it's a metal container already. Uh, so as the wax melts, where's it going? Nowhere. Nowhere. That's right. So as the, as the wax melts, it will stay within this container. You let it cool, and voila, you're going to have your candle essentially back to its original form. Okay, for the next time. All right. So mm. other little things that you probably need in here from a, a winter survival standpoint. Chapstick, definitely. My um, lips are already chapped. Chapstick. What, okay, what is this? that's that's a medical. Again, this is my general. He's got a little out medical. Bag. He's got some wound stuff. He's got some chapstick. But I would he's say the some... essential stuff for. Is this iodine for water. Here, there should be a look in there for a emergency blanket. The essential stuff for a winter well, you had situation. You a poncho somewhere too. That's right. This could be warm. A winter situation. Or okay, just to re recap. Okay, all this other stuff is fine, but from an essential standpoint. This is my favorite. Yeah. What does that do? You know? It's winding it up so I can have light. It does allow for light. There it is. Is okay. there something else? It's a hand charge. A so even if you don't have batteries, you hand crank it, you're going to generate uh, energy. Indefinitely? Forever yes, there's, and ever? there's a cell in there where you're actually generating energy. It's stored in that cell. But the nice thing about this contraption, and you can find these things again on I feel like eBay. I could... It's also got like this thing where if okay. I needed to, Here, I could like here's, tie it to myself. Or you could just open the, the snap. What snap? This thing? Yeah. The nice thing about that. Oh, whoa. Okay. It's like a carabiner. That's right. Okay. All right, good. Focus. Let me see that for a second. What are you doing with it? Because what does everybody have? A phone. Yeah. So the nice thing <gasps> about this is USB? you put your USB Hold on, can I charge my phone? into it. And Make sure your adapter is right for the phone absolutely. if you've upgraded. That's it. I like All to right. do that wrong. So there you go. So there you're able to charge your phone. You you zap this Wait, thing go with, ahead some, charge with some it, energy. I'm not showing a charge line yet. There's probably not enough energy in here. All right. Wait, I want to I want to just see. There, oh, it, there is. it is. Okay. We're okay. charging. We're actually charging her phone. I took it out. I don't know if this is a good idea to charge her phone or not. But you know what? That's going to keep you warm too. Charge it. It, pr it probably <laughs> will. Yeah, not only that, but you know, I've got a couple other things in here that are chargeable, like my well, one-handed, one my one-handed uh, plasma Zippo lighter. Plasma. You know, this guy's awesome. That's her favorite thing. All right, put let's your light in there. something. No, let's not light, light your candle. No, no. Right, I wanna, okay. We're gonna have but lunch. We're gonna have If you need, if you need to charge that, then the same same way. Give me that. Do it. Um, it's a USB charge. Okay. All right. Might be a little difficult because I can't get in there. But since you want, you insist. Okay, wait. Uh, let's. You know what? Let me use my. Oh, he got it. He got it. There it is. Okay. I was gonna use some other lint thing. Okay. Yeah, you could. Eric, All right. Let's have lunch at NRV at the table go. on this beautiful. All right. Holiday. So, Becky, mm -hmm. did you learn anything today? I learned that I need a junk bag like this that has tons of you. It's not a junk bag. No useful stuff. Everything is purposeful. No, this is. This scares me. We're gonna get back to this because I got a car in the past, but I'm really gonna just not go. After that's the problem. Make a list. Make a list. Check it twice. You know yeah. what's coming after the fall. That's right. That's right. Um, no, it's And all this, this other stuff is this? just great bonus. That's just another little sleep in, mini sleeping bag, uh, cross between an emergency blanket and a sleeping bag. Like you can make yourself a giant burrito. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> An emergency giant burrito. Okay. okay. But all this Knife. stuff is intended to keep you alive in a situation. This keep is Keep you good. warm in a situation until help is on the way. Now I will say. As a final tip, you don't need gas. You I need would stay with the vehicle. A lot of people, if they get stuck. They're like, I'm going to go hiking for help. Can't you just like hit no, Tesla emergency call? You you could if somebody <laughs> could get to you. But if you're out there stuck, I don't know if you're going to get too much help. So the, this, the reality is, are you safer in a car or are you safer out walking on an icy road with people maybe driving fast by you no, that, that bad. are going to hit you possibly because they don't see you? Another reason to have a headlamp. Uh, Wait, so but, so but, I see something missing then, like a flare, uh, some kind of thing to like, because if you're pulled over in a snowstorm and you're hunkered yeah, down yeah. and they're zipping past you, they might clip you, yeah. no? Yeah, they could. You know, you, you got like, the hazard lights, you could probably pop. But if, if it were me, I would stay with the vehicle. Okay. A flare probably would be a good thing to have. Or just some in kind case of like, uh, like a like a light up flashing yeah. hazard sign. Yeah. Like the sure. construction worker. Sure, we could do that. We could do yeah. that. So, anyway. I think you should leave in the comments what top three things you feel like next. Top three things. 
top three things we're needing next. Like I, I would vote just based on flare. this. A flare. Okay. Um, you got water, fire. We got the uh, basics. Well, I need to get out of there, so call. I need to call. Is there like an emergency beacon thing I can hit off? Yeah, uh, maybe. Maybe. I think basically Because up this there you might not have reception. Well, you're going to be stuck on the side of a road until somebody finds you. And that probably, you know, maybe 12 it's hours, a, two, a two maybe, days max. Maybe, you know, until they open the pass back up and... Uh, Will your car make it two days with the lights on and charging and heat? That's why I have all this stuff. I don't need the car. This is... The car is my... Shelter, my enclave. Yes. Okay. okay. All right. Maybe so, a heating blanket, like some kind of thing. This video that like will a, never end. <laughs> <laughs> some kind of snap heat thing, heating pads, those heat warmers, those hot warmers. I got those Bobby, in my car. Me. You guys will see my car next. There's like three things in it, but All I right, do have well, a half a gallon of water. Anyway, so. we hope you guys learned something and take the stuff to heart. This is the time to get ready for the for winter. You don't want to wait until you're needing to get ready. You want to be ready ahead of time and practice the stuff. Know what's in your kit and be ready to go, all right? Feed your freedom, nutrient survival. Be I'm prepared. EC, who are you? BG, stay prepared, all don't right. be scared. And that's Bobby. Get it together. Later. Bye!